So for the icing, because we're going to start with the icing, I, I'm going to go ahead and put it in the fridge to, to chill. Um, I want to say thank you to House of Nass Heats, and I'm hoping I spell that right or pronounce that right. Dot com. Uh, so after this video, why don't you jump over there and give her some love and check her out her Pinterest when you're done watching the videos. And I will link her to her website to the description. So for the royal icing, we're going to have um, four cups of powdered sugar, four cups of powdered sugar, one gel food coloring, any colors that you chose, that you choose, four tablespoons of meringue powder. one tablespoon of vanilla and six tablespoons of water. So we're going to combine all those together and see what we're going to get. You can stop it. Get started. So right now I'm scooping out the first of the uh, powdered sugar into the one cup. And I'm making a mess doing it. Oops. Which is not actually a bad thing. As I said in my very first video, if I'm not ha uh, making a mess, I'm not having any fun. Got it. So there's one cup. And I think I'm going to need a bigger bowl. That's what happens when you're ill-prepared. No, I just didn't... I mistook it for the... for needing a small bowl. <laughs> That's all it is. No, really? I hope you're cleaning this after you're done. Oh, I will. Uh-huh. Yeah, that or Angela will do it. Because it's her night to do dishes anyway. Me. Mm. I'm being a pain in her butt. As always. My husband is behind the camera today, and if you want to go check out his Twitch, it's Sir or Sir underscore no beard. Come on, say it. You say it. If you want to see my Twitch, it's Sir underscore no beard at twitch.com. I may have to get into the other, to the new uh, powdered sugar. Yeah, it looks like you're scraping bare bottoms. You're so corny sometimes. I'm so corny. Well, I don't have any ears. <laughs> Sorry about the uh, scraping noise. No, she's not. <clears throat> How many cups was that? Only three, I think. Think. How many was it? It was three. Okay. <laughs> a lot of sugar, y'all. It is a lot of sugar. All right, you're gonna have to pause that. So we got our new uh, <laughs> bag of powdered sugar. <laughs> Are you sure it's not an old bag? No, you're an old bag. I'm an old hag, yes. Alright, so there's four cups of powdered sugar. That's a lot of sugar. It is a lot of sugar. Somebody's going to get hyper today. 
but we're also making quite a bit of cookies too. So, in the next video, let's uh, clean this off just a little bit because we won't need the cup measurements anymore. off my computer. Cleaning all that mess. Yep. And if you have a clean table, you just uh, recycle it. If not, you throw it away. It is a clean table. However, I make bread and all sorts of things on here, so you never know what's on here. <laughs> all right, now we're gonna add the meringue powder, which is four tablespoons of meringue powder. You wanna bring that up close, hon, so I can actually see. Is that too close? No, nope, got it. Okay. I can get it open. Ta da. I think. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Ta da. I've never used this. This is something I. This is the first time for me. And remember, it's adult proof. Really? Adult proof? Hey, I gotta throw some commentary that makes people laugh. Four tablespoons. I got some brown sugar on it from earlier <laughs> when I made bread. Nice powdery substance. There's one tablespoon. <clears throat> Two tablespoons. Three tablespoons. Floor. And four tablespoons. And you can see, kids, we can count. Wow. Hey, I'm the comedic. I'm the comedic relief here. We're gonna try the comedic relief here. Um, mm -hmm. One teaspoon. I use a teaspoon for my for my other video or for my bread to make bread twice a week. What's <coughs> up <coughs> like that? Teaspoon. So I need four one teaspoon one teaspoon of vanilla. Just one teaspoon of vanilla. Good old vanilla. Wish it was chocolate. <laughs> The look on your face, priceless. And six tablespoons of water. I've got my water right here, just prepped. One, two, three, four, six, and then we're going to add our gel food coloring just one color but what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to separate excuse me separate this into smaller bowls I think that's what I was planning with the original um, you have to mix it up first before you yeah I'm going to I'm going to be mixing it up I just got to get a spoon get a whisk it's a lot easier get a whisk instead yes okay you want to come show what this looks like We may need more 
water. Yeah, she's probably going to need a little more water. Seems like my whisk is just <laughs> is kind of like. <laughs> I'm dry. Give me more agua. No, my my whisk is falling apart. <laughs> it's because it's old here. You need new whisks. Which is why I always use a spoon. But whisks are so much simpler. Okay. And look, it's already starting to turn to icing. Yep. And that's why it's only one food coloring. Okay. I'd have to like double, triple the batch if I wanted to do more. Yes, you would. Okay. And I'm going to get a spoon. Because this whisk is just... It's had it. <laughs> Sad. But I still use it. It's had it. I may be disabled, but I still use it. And then, Tim, what color do you think we ought to use? Blue. I don't have a blue. Black. Don't have a black. I have a pink, a purple, a green, and a orange. You don't have the blue one anymore? Tim, these are the liquid ones. Yeah. No, there was no blue. Okay, fine. Purple. Purple? First one I pulled out of my hand. That looks so wrong. I Try not to get any on me. <laughs> I think it's empty. Not quite. It's gotta be, because all I hear is air. It's still coming out. <laughs> get every last drop. There, I got it. I think I got it all. <laughs> Come on, hands, stop shaking. That's got anti shake. I know. And now you have purple icing. So don't use this on regular. You'll have to come over here and. Because I'm turning the bowl. Yeah, I know. I don't need to see that much. First it was white, and now it's purple. Now we're going to go ahead and put this in the um, refrigerator to chill <clears throat> until I'm ready to use it for the cookies. And until then, see you for the next video. Remember, be kind to yourself, be kind to others, and because you never know what somebody's going through. Or has been through. Ta-ta for now. Guys, welcome back. Uh, it's been a couple of days. So, now we're going to, I've got the icing out thawing, or, you know, being out of the refrigerator too warm, um, to room temperature. So now we're getting to the cookies. Um, for the cookies, we're going to need two and three quarter cup of flour. Look at that dust. <laughs> Glad I'm not over there. I'd be sneezing. Uh, one teaspoon of bake or er, yeah, one teaspoon of baking soda, and I have it in here. Half a teaspoon of baking powder, and one cup of softened butter. I've got a stick and three quarters here of butter, um, so we're going to see if it works having that much, having that little for this. Here's the... I need that for the... I know. Just go grab a knife.
sorry about the scraping, guys. Gotta get every little bit. even. Alright, so we got that. And then we're going to take... Mm -mm. What? Nothing. We're going to take a fork first. And we're going to cut... I need you to come closer. We're going to cut the butter into... the flour mixture. Just like so. Okay, now that it's cut, we need one and a half cups of white sugar and one, one egg. And then we're going to mix that all together as well. And we need one teaspoon of vanilla extract. I know it doesn't look like cookies right now, but it will. I hope. <laughs> yes, I've never made this this uh, one before. I don't know where it came from. A friend of mine went ahead and gave me the recipe. So. to preheat at 375 or 190 degrees Celsius. Uh, really hope you had 375 since it's been uh, kind of scratched off. And because of fall we're, and school's getting ready to start, I've got a little pencil here. We're going to cut out the cute little shapes. Place them on my nonstick sheet. We're going to have really thick, <laughs> thick cookies. <laughs> um, and we've got a uh, turkey. leaf, a maple leaf. Let me get a knife real quick. Hold that up. She needs a knife. 
Tim. Yes. <laughs> You're being so funny. I'm trying to. And we're gonna do different sized pumpkins. Of course, that's what Paul needs is pumpkins. More pumpkin spice. That's a big pumpkin. Sick pumpkin. I got a little tiny one right here. A tiny little pumpkin. Oh, lost his. <laughs> So we don't waste any dough. We're just going to go ahead and smush it all back together. It's kind of crumbly. I think it's because we didn't have as much um, butter as we should have. And yes, I was very surprised when I was told that this one had no milk in it whatsoever. Another pumpkin. That one's gonna crumble. Nah, you know what? I don't want that one. We'll go ahead and recut it. <laughs> recut it. <laughs> that looks a little bit better. Somebody's going to have sugar diabetes tonight. No. Why do you think you're going to have diabetes tonight? Because they look yummy. <laughs> All the pumpkins. More pumpkins. And I'll get another tray. to go for eight to ten minutes. At three seventy five, eight to ten minutes. Yes. Three seventy five, eight to ten minutes. So we're pulling the last one out. It smells like cookies in here. Expectation versus reality. <laughs> so now we just let them cool. So now we just let them cool on the um, cooling rack and uh, we can ice them as soon as they're cooled. We'll see you then. Okay, okay guys, now we're going to ice our expectation versus reality um, <laughs> cookies. <laughs> uh, we're going to use the purple that I made the other day and of course we're just going to Ice a little bit of it and try it and make sure that it tastes good. It's the only reason I'm icing them on camera because I just want to see if they taste good. And I have a, a sugar, really big sugar thing. <laughs> I don't. Um, okay. <laughs> I had a big bite. <laughs> that was a good bite. Um, they're actually really good. They're definitely prettier than they, than they, um, they may not be pretty, but they taste good. So, that's the end of the video with as messy as I am. <laughs> Don't forget to like and subscribe. Please like and subscribe, and feel free to like it, hit the subscribe button, and the little for notification bell, um, and click all to know when I post a new video. Sorry. <laughs> uh, if you want to follow me on Instagram and Twitter, I'll have those linked below. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. <laughs> be kind to others, be kind to yourself, because you never know what someone is going through or has gone through. <laughs> Bye guys.